This video is going to show you how to jailbreak your iPhone 4 or iPhone 3GS on firmware 4.3.1 using Snowbreeze. First, you need to download two files from the video description, the Snowbreeze file and the iPhone 4.3.1 firmware file. And both of those links are located in the video description. Then click on Snowbreeze. Then click Next. Then click Browse. Then select the iPhone 4.3.1 firmware file that was downloaded, then click Open. If you have the iPhone 3GS, then a pop-up menu will come up, and it will ask you if you have the old boot ROM or the new boot ROM iPhone 3GS. If you don't know which one you have, select Detect it for me. And if you have the old boot ROM, you can add custom boot logos. Then click Next. Then select Expert Mode. Then click on General and then click next. Now this part's important. If you have an iPhone with an official SIM, such as AT&T, then you don't need to select activate the iPhone. But if you don't have an official AT&T SIM card, then Snowbreeze will have to activate your phone for you. So then you'll have to select activate the iPhone, activate. Only select that option if you don't have an official SIM. Then click next. Then this option will come up. If you plan to unlock your phone later, then you will need to be on one of six baseband versions, and I will list those in the video description. But if you don't have one of those six, then you will need to install the iPad baseband in order to unlock your iPhone. Then click Next. Then you can select custom boot logos. Then click Next. Then select Build IPSW, and then click Next. And now it's going to build the firmware file, and this will take about 3 to 5 minutes. And once it's done creating the IPSW, click OK. And then connect your iPhone to the computer, and then turn it off. Then click Start. Press the home and power buttons for 10 seconds. Then release the power button, but keep holding the home button. And now your device is in DFU mode. Then click OK. And then you can exit Snowbreeze. Now open iTunes, then click OK, and shift click on Restore, and then select the Snowbreeze file for your iPhone that was just created, and that file starts with Snowbreeze, and it should be located on your desktop. Then click Open. And now iTunes will apply the new software to your iPhone. Once iTunes has finished installing the software on your iPhone, then it will reboot. And then Cydia will be installed, and then your device will be jailbroken on 4.3.1.